You want to answer questions from the fan, George? Here, here's a couple. All right. All right. These are off the Stern Fan Network or off the Are they corner. real? Yeah, no, they're, I mean, they're questions, and they were, they were put forth by listeners. We didn't write these. Did we? <laughs> you didn't. Good. Have you ever tried dr drugs, and if so, which ones? This was asked by a fan? Yes. No, I have not. Okay. Never smoked dope? Never. Well, <laughs> you know, we're you, we were young. Dope. Yeah. So you smoked dope. Did you ever take acid? No, no. Ever take but, uh, uh, hash, hash oil? No. Ever take shrooms? Cocaine? No. Shrooms? No. Hash oil? No. Only marijuana. Heroin? Long, long time ago. Black beauties? <laughs> no. No. Uh, qu quaaludes? No. No. Oh, you've done quaaludes. No, no, no. No, no. I don't believe that. You know, I'm I'm a runner, and, uh, you know, this body is a machine. You no. can't. Uh, Pickle Artie's is a wonderful machine. It is. <laughs> no, but and you got to take care of it, Artie. Artie's is a drug you, receptacle. You know, I could give you a lot of advice. <laughs> <laughs> it's a wonderful machine. Can I quote you on that, Artie? All right, here you are. Here's another question for you. Are you cut or uncut? Well, um, I'm Buddhist. Which means? Which means you're uncut? We believe in naturalness. Oh, really? Mm. So you've got a big snuffleupagus down there. One with the world. Wow. you got like an elephant trunk with a... <laughs> you and Fred. You and Fred have a sword fight. Okay. Uh, 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 what do your parents think of your lifestyle? Uh, I don't think this uh, was written by a fan. Yeah, oh, I swear sure to God. These are, I swear on, on my children. Our we fans either, are crazy. We got these... <laughs> you know, I... I I don't believe a thing on this show. I know. <laughs> but these are really, I swear. You have blown all trust that I have in you guys. Well, let me ask him anyway, whether you believe it or not. What do your parents think of your lifestyle? You must have strict Asian parents. All Asian parents are strict. Now, what do they think My of My parents have passed. Yes. Uh, were they aware of your uh, gay lifestyle? My father passed before uh, before I came out. But uh, What do you mean, before, before you came out of uh, the, the family? Closet. Yes. To the family. I think about before you came out of the vagina. Oh. <laughs> but uh, so, so your mom... My no. father was very liberal, and I would like to think that he would have understood. Right. My mother had some adjustment problems initially, but uh, she came to like, you know, it's when uh, I got together with Brad that uh, I came out. Uh -huh. And uh, my mother loved Brad very much. And, I mean, this is something about Brad. When my mother got ill, and um, she got al Alzheimer's. And it became very. Do you think she got Alzheimer's because she wanted to forget I you were gay? Trying to forget. Okay. <laughs> well, she. We moved her in with us, oh. and she was with us the last four years of her life. And it was, believe me, if anyone has experienced Alzheimer's, it can be horrific. It, it, it is horrible. Yeah. Yeah. Do you, do All you, the various stages. And Brad did you ever was fake, a killer. Did you ever oh, fake killer. girlfriends to your mom? Did you ever bring home women and pretend? I did. You did. I did. Early wow. on. That must have been wild. No, no, uh, you know, they loved... Why did the women like, go along with it? They they thought they were your girlfriend? Uh, well, back then when I was a teenager? Yeah. Yeah. Oh, they did. Yeah. Okay. Where's the strangest place you ever had sex? And I don't mean like, you know, butt or something. I mean like a public <laughs> a place. place. A, a real place. That's right. Um, on a deserted island. But would you believe the Sulu Sea? <laughs> I was doing a film on location in uh, the Philippines. And after we finished uh, work on the film... Brad and I. Oh, oh, as a matter of fact, I got a job for uh, Brad on the film. Uh -huh. You know, he's he used to be as lean as a rail. I was playing a. Uh, Is he uh, fat now? No, no, no. He's still he's still mm -hmm. very lean. But uh, I was playing a concentration camp, uh, a prisoner of war camp commandant, and we needed skinny, emaciated, gaunt, <laughs> Caucasian men. And you don't call Stern. <laughs> Uh, like, well, like, he looks you, more like a concentration camp victim. You than certainly do, and you could have qualified. I could, got, I could have gotten you a job as an extra. That would have been some movie, like that blocked up the top Jew. I had Brad as one of my inmates and had him carrying these great oh huge my. loads, sacks of <laughs> big rice. Loads, are <laughs> loads, loads of rice. Loads and sacks. <laughs> What's the strangest place you had sex? Is well, the island? Okay, uh, and after the film... We uh, uh, went to, uh, to I, I wanted to see the Sulu Sea, you know, because of my connection with with the Sulu. So we found an island called El or a resort called El Nido on this uh, El Nido, on the, El, N I D O, uh, oh, which in Spanish means the bird's nest. It's on the um, uh, island of Palawan. All right, so get to the sex. What happened? And Elena? we went to this deserted island. Yes. And there and we spent got... the whole day yeah. clothesless. Oh. Absolutely new. Oh, yeah. <laughs> wow. It was a glorious experience. Wait, the two of you guys were running around nude on on Sulu Island? Uh, 
No, no, no. This was, uh, uh, El, uh, El, I mean, El Nido. Yes. N I B O. Nido. Bird's Nest. This just said, this just said George's father woke up and killed himself. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, and then we had a young Filipino boy come in a boat. Uh, well, a Filipino oh. a boy in a boat <laughs> took us there <laughs> yeah. to that island. Yeah. And he waited behind uh, one of these rocks, you know, all day long. Oh, all day long. Oh, oh. <laughs> he didn't join in? <laughs> oh, no, no. No. I had Brad. You never made it on the day there. And then he, uh, but when you romped uh, around naked and what? And performed fellatio on one another? We just... Became one with that island. Wow. <laughs> Unbelievable. Well, you really are out of the club. <laughs> when you get back to the boat with the Filipino boy, is he like discreet? I mean, does he know he's that very you guys discreet? Are, yeah. you guys very are, like, discreet. Walking with a limp. <laughs> <laughs> oh no! We you were never did it on air. You never did it on the Star Trek set. No, never. No, no. Hmm. Ever make a sex tape with your boyfriend? Are you on video somewhere? No, no, no. no you would no, never no, do no. that. I think that Filipino boy is going to sell one. <laughs> I mean, have, have you? you hey, wait a second. <laughs> have you? No, they didn't have videos back that then. That Filipino <laughs> boy's got a video. Hey, uh, so, so George. Yes. Have you ever worn your Star Trek uniform while having sex? Be honest. How can you do that? Oh, come on. You oh, you mean you just you, you just start out with your <laughs> uniform. Have you ever played uh, a, a, a Mr. Sulu in the bedroom? No, no. Have you ever been dressed Never. on the Star Trek set and Brad came to visit you and, you know, here's the captain's log. <laughs> <laughs> Have you had a threesome with two men? Well, <laughs> I can count more than that. Oh, okay. <laughs> How many men? Well, you know, this was before Brad. Right. And uh, I, he is listening. I mean, what time is it now in Los Angeles? You know what? He's a dude. He can get over it. He can handle it. Hey, Brad, it. guess what? George got it on with a bunch of guys before you. Yeah. I mean, this was before him. Yeah. So how many? Agreement to agreement. I don't care how you know, We have tape of it. <laughs> oh, I'm sure you guys will fabricate something like that. But, you know, the term girn, uh, uh, loins being girded, I really know what the meaning of that word is now here. <laughs> Well, uh, how many guys were a part of your... It was started a, out with the Laker game. It was a group of people. Yes. Like 20? I didn't count. Oh, no, no, no not that, that many. Not that many. Not that 10? Many. I actually do have... Mm, somewhere around that. Oh. All men? Yes. Wow. Well. I actually I have... love to get on my knees and shine Ricardo Montalban through <laughs> I do. Where is that tape I played this morning of George actually uh, having uh, sex? Oh my goodness! This is on El Nido. I can't even. Bother. <laughs> there is El Nido. I have <laughs> some Fonzie with that. I have the tape of El Nido, it's but I can't N -I -D -O. find it. I don't know which page it's on. It's on ninety-seven different pages. <laughs> oh, here it is. I oh, I'm sorry I shared this. I'm sure I'm going to be hearing about this for years on end now. Here it is. <laughs> George Decay. Yeah. Doing work here, huh? Oh, my God. Yes, yes. Yeah? See what kind of bar this is? What kind of bar is it? Gesticulating cowboy. <laughs> Think you can handle it? With pleasure. Oh, my God. Holy jeez. What do you say, boy? I want your wang. That's right. Well, look it up. Yeah, get in there. Go on. Oh. Uh, yeah. Yes. Yeah, there you go. Oh. Uh, yeah. Oh. Yes. Yeah. Oh. Oh, yeah. Oh. 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 Holy jeez. Yeah. Oh. Now, yeah. oh, there you go. That's some hidden tape from El Nido. <laughs> I think a week here has been enough. <laughs> You're ready to go. You're ready to fly out the door. I'm ready for home. <laughs> I think he's going to skip the theater and go right to the airport. <laughs> you get out of town. And interviewed Brad as well. Yeah. The yes. news department. Yeah, the news department. Oh, we'll hear that at noon. Get at ready for noon. a good reaming. <laughs> <laughs>